this video, I will show you how to sew on a button and the steps to get there. First, you will need a needle and thread, material or what you are sewing the button to, scissors and the button. First step. You need to put everything but your needle, thread and scissors to the side. And you need to cut off 50 about 50 centimetres of your thread. Here's one I did earlier. Now take up your needle and try and poke the end of your thread through the hole of your needle. Sometimes it does not go through straight away like it did there. So what you need to do is take the scissors and cut off the end of the thread and then try again. Keep trying until you get the needle threaded up. Once you've got your needle threaded, you need to pull through 5 or 10 centimetres of your thread on the other side. Now take up the end of your thread and we need to tie a knot. This makes it secure and so it won't pull through as you're sewing. So you need to make an X over it with the long thread over the shorter. And then push the smaller thread through the loop and then pull tight. The knot will be quite small so we need to do it again. So just repeat the previous steps. There you go, now you've done your knot. Now you need to bring back your material and button. You need to place your button on your material where you would like to sew it on. Then take up your threaded needle and poke it through the back and into one of the holes. I usually start with the top left as it makes it neater and it's easier to sew. And then you need to pull it through. And now there's four holes but you need to go to the one next to it and then pull it tight. Now go to the hole below this. It won't always go straight through, so you need to keep trying. Once you've got it through, you need to pull tight again. and then poke it through the same as you did before. And you need to do this about four times for my size button and three times for a smaller size button. Sometimes the end of your thread gets too close to where you're sewing. So what you need to do is pull the needle slightly and make that tail bit shorter so it's easier to sew. Now I've done it three times. This is my last time. Now 
Now on the back, your button won't be secure yet. So what you need to do is poke your needle through the stitches you have on the back, but don't go through your material. Because you do not want these to show up. You need to do this twice. Then take your scissors and cut off your needle and thread. And now you're sewing on your buttons.